We continue our coverage of the allegations against the North Carolina Speaker of the House. A lawsuit claims Tim Moore used his position to pursue a three-year extramarital affair. Speaker Moore says it's a baseless lawsuit. And while this is ironed out in the courts, the business of running the state has to move forward. I spoke to political scientist Chris Cooper about what this means for the legislature. While claims and accusations from a list of people go back and forth with the North Carolina Speaker of the House at the center of it all, the General Assembly has a lot to finish up this legislative session. So there's a lot going on around Tim Moore himself, but also around what he wants in terms of public policy. So this is an absolutely critical time for Moore, for the Republican Party, and for just North Carolina politics in general. Lawmakers have already said they'll be in Raleigh longer than expected so they can get a budget to the governor's desk. That was before before the news of the lawsuit against Speaker Moore. We've got a series of bills, a lot of revolving around elections, but not only elections, that will presumably be passed out of both chambers soon to the governor's desk. We've got the budget out there and those negotiations where the House and the Senate are trying to work things out. And not too far on the horizon, we have new congressional and state and Senate election maps that have to be drawn. Political scientist Chris Cooper says it's not the claims of an affair that is most critical, but that Moore is accused of, quote, egregious abuse of power. Speaker Moore calls the claims baseless. I mean, it's hard to think of a more powerful politician in the state of North Carolina than Tim Moore. Maybe Phil Berger. Maybe you can make an argument about Roy Cooper. But I mean, you are going at somebody who is on the Mount Rushmore of power in the state of North Carolina with some personal allegations, but again, with some much bigger allegations as well. So this is going to get really dicey. And we can't stress enough, these are allegations at this mm -hmm. moment, just allegations. Uh, if you want to know more about what's within that lawsuit, our Haley Fixler's been on this all day.